Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the WFP invalid operation blue screen error that you are experiencing on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we are going to start off by opening up the search menu. Type in verifier. Go ahead and run that command. Select yes if you receive a user account control prompt. Select create standard settings and then select next. Next again. And basically this drive verifier tool will usually indicate if there's issues with signed drivers on your computer. So this could definitely be a potential reason why you're having a problem. You can see we didn't have any unsigned drivers, but go ahead and select next. You can see no unsigned drivers have been found. If you had any particular problematic drivers, you could then look into remedying that, whether through updating or removing that driver and reinstalling it. So that's the first thing I'd recommend taking a look at there. Something else we can try here as well, if you open up the search menu and type in CMD, best match, or come back with command prompt, right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And then into this elevator command line window, you want to type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin that scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. And once it has concluded, close out of here, and you want to restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that was a pretty straightforward process. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.